python i am going to implement six functions to convert celsius to fahrenheit fahrenheit to celsius celsius to kelvin kelvin to celsius fahrenheit to kelvin and kelvin to fahrenheit let's begin program command simple temperature conversion so i am going to implement six functions function number 1 convert from celsius to fahrenheit def c to f and we pass temperature that is celsius okay so we will return c celsius and that is multiplied by 9.0 divided by 5.0 and plus 32 this is over function for celsius to f fahrenheit now the function convert to convert fahrenheit to celsius def f to c fahrenheit and we return fahrenheit minus 32 and multiply by 5.0 divided by 9.0 okay now for a circus centigrade to kelvin celsius to kelvin so def c to k and celsius and we return celsius and plus 273.15 that is absolute zero value in kelvin function to convert kelvin to celsius so def k to c kelvin and we return kelvin minus 273.15 that is absolute zero value now the function fahrenheit to kelvin so def f to k and fahrenheit and we call two functions to convert it first function c to return c to k and then f to c and pass fahrenheit that is that's it it will convert fahrenheit to kelvin now the function to convert kelvin to fahrenheit def k to f and kelvin and we return c to k sorry k to c and f to sorry k to c and c to f okay first we convert kelvin to centigrade and then we convert centigrade to fahrenheit now menu function display menu and get users choice def menu okay print welcome to temperature menu print number 1 celsius to 
Fahrenheit. Print Fahrenheit to Kelvin. Sorry, Celsius. Print. Celsius to Kelvin. Print Kelvin to Celsius. Now Fahrenheit. Number five Fahrenheit to Kelvin. And number six. Kelvin to foreign height. Okay, now exit. Zero is accurate. Okay, now choice. Choice is equal to zero. And we return choice. Now loop while. Let's say minus one. Is less than zero or choice is greater than Six. Continue. So print. Enter choice. Let's say choice is equal to int. Input. Enter choice. And error message. If choice is less than zero or choice is greater than six, print invalid input. Enter zero to six. That's it guys, our function is ready. Let's write the mean method now. Hold on. So guys, mean function and we show the menu and get the input and run the function. So, choice is equal to manual okay while twice is not equal to zero we print sorry we call the function let's read input read input so input is equal to int let's say float input enter temperature to convert okay now based on user's choice if choice is equal to 1 so this is c to f so we call the function and uh, let's say print So guys, we call the C2F function here and print the value. So let's print F, mm, let's say value 0.2F and this conversion is from Celsius to Fahrenheit. That is, we call the function here and it is C to F and we pass the value and set the formatting to two decimal point and same way let's test it first okay so one and twenty five so our value is printed here So let's put a new line here. Print. This will clean up the space. Okay, now let's print it. Mm, just copy this one also. Okay. LF choice is equal to 2. Sorry. Copy. 
and this is f to c so we change the values celsius to oh sorry fahrenheit to celsius now lf qic is equal to 3 and this is f2 uh, sorry this is sc to k to kelvin c to k this is f2 c okay now fourth option lf choice is equal to 4 and this is k to c kelvin to celsius now fifth option lf choice is equal to 5 and this is F two K for I two K and now last option else L F choice is equal to six that is K two F Kelvin to Fahrenheit. Now last option else print of goodbye print okay that's it we are done and let's test it okay number one temperature to convert from celsius to Fahrenheit. Let's say 32. This is over temperature in Fahrenheit. Okay. Why oh, it is running twice? Okay. I think I repeated something. Let me check. Okay. We do not know menu. Okay. We need to call a menu function here. Okay, choice is equal to menu. Okay, stop it and run it. Okay, Celsius 32, our answer is there. Number 2 Fahrenheit, let's say 89. And we have Celsius. And now we have uh, number 4 Kelvin, let's say 700. And it is converted to Celsius. Kelvin to Celsius. It should be less. Okay, F to C, C to K, and this is K to C. And this is F to K, and this is K to F. And that's it. Stop and run. Okay, let's say 4, 700. Okay, now it is good. Now, Kelvin to Fahrenheit, number 6, let's say 600, 500, and there is additional argument. Okay, the value is not positive, Kelvin. Okay, so it is all bug free now, number 6, and this is power 500, and our value is there. That's it, guys. Thank you very much. And please subscribe to the channel to promote the videos. Thank you. Have a good day. See you in the next video.